After the deadly mass shooting at a block party on Detroit's east side last weekend, the police department has a new initiative called the Neighborhood Response Team. CBS News Detroit's Walter Murphy was there for the first roll call tonight. What can you tell us, Walter? Yes, Shana, so that news actually comes on the heels of another announcement that all calls to illegal block parties have been upgraded to priority one by the department. But like you mentioned, I got to see the new neighborhood response team in person tonight, and I got to take an up close look at what they'll be doing on the city's streets. Through this door stand 80 Detroit police officers reporting for duty to fulfill a different role for the first time on Friday night. It's called the Neighborhood Response Team, and it's made up of officers across several precincts and divisions within the department, all with the same goal, to stop illegal block parties. We shut it down. We're going to be professional, we're going to be polite, allow them time, give them time to leave, but we're shutting it down. We certainly see a sharp increase in outdoor events during the summertime. In the last 30 days, Detroit police have responded to around 500 illegal gatherings including the deadly shooting last weekend that killed two and injured 19 others. A tragedy the department never wants to see again. We certainly don't. The, again, a key aspect of this initiative is early intervention. Let's stop the problem before it turns into something more serious. And this is basically where more or less the magic happens. Officers will be doing street patrols, but will be getting much of the information that they use from the real-time crime center downtown, which monitors things like social media and relays that information to the neighborhood response team out in the field. But Sergeant John Stewart says this is only one piece of the puzzle, and a layered approach will be needed to stop crime in the Motor City. The community is probably our best partner and our biggest piece in this thing, and the neighborhood response team gives us a way to interface with them in a non-enforcement environment and just say, hey, look, we're here to partner with you. Let's stop these folks from taking our neighborhoods hostage. Now, the Detroit Police Department wants to remind everyone if they see any illegal gatherings to call 911 immediately. Shana. All right, Walter, thank you very much.